Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I am back with a Walmart haul and I also have some items from TJ Maxx. So this is a collective haul. Um, I know y'all are probably thinking y'all are not going to see me for another week or two, but I'm back with another video and y'all know I'm trying to get back into my regular content again. So without further ado, if you'd like to see what I picked up at Walmart and TJ Maxx, then please stay tuned. The first thing I have here from Walmart is a water bottle. I saw this and it just said my name. Of course, it's purple. Y'all know that's my favorite color. It is by the brand Built. It is an 18 ounce water bottle with a flip top. It holds cold items for 24 hours and hot items for six hours. And it is BPA free, vacuum insulated, double wall stainless steel. So I love the color, of course. I had to get it because of that color. And then I love that it has this little purple handle. And when it says that it's flip top, you just open it like that and you're able to drink out of it. And this top is very secure and it snaps. So I love that I could just drink this with one hand and it's not one big, huge bottle. Um, it's got the nice secure top on it so I can put it in my big tote bag for work. And I love that. So I have a nice refillable water bottle that is cute and fashionable. And if I want, I could put like water bottle stickers on there. At Walmart, I also picked up this Kiss um, what are they calling this? A top knot pre-tied turban. Um, I thought it was just something cute to pick up for when I do have my hair like this and I'm just around the house. I could just put this on and I thought it was really cute. So I grabbed that. At Walmart, I did also grab uh, two of the Terra and Sky V-neck shirts. And I love the simple V-neck cotton shirts. Um, I picked up a handful of them at Target a couple years ago, and I still have those same shirts. I love them. They're just very comfortable to wear. Um, if you're just chilling at the house, if you're running out to run errands or anything like that, um, it's not anything super fash uh, flashy or dressy. I have, you know, clothes for that, but I just wanted something to throw on that wasn't an actual, I guess, t-shirt. It's a cotton shirt, but it's not like a graphic tee. Um, it's the basic shirt, like solid color. Um, it's a semi-fitted, made with 58% Pima cotton, P-I-M-A, um, and it's the Terry and Sky V-neck core tee. Um, I did get it in a 3X, which is a 24 or 26. I wanted to fit, I wanted it to fit a little bit big on me, and I wanted it to be long enough. So I got it in the 3X, and these were $7.97. I got this one in navy blue, and then I'm wearing one in the green color and I love it. So I wore that today and it's super cute and it feels great on my skin. So these two items are completely random. I know I was actually in Walmart looking for a gift and I happened to look in the $5 movie bin, which I never really do anymore. Y'all know we have like Amazon video and uh, Hulu, Netflix, all those streaming apps, but you can't go wrong with the good old Walmart $5 bin. So I picked up a few DVDs. I grabbed Edward Scissorhands, which is a classic. If you've never seen it, it has Winona Ryder and Johnny Depp in it. So I grabbed that. And then I also picked up Candyman. Y'all, I've never seen Candyman. Don't jump down my throat. I've always been too scared to watch it based on hearing stuff from other people. But I found it in the $5 bin at Walmart and I had to pick it up. So if you've never seen Candyman before, it's a horror movie. I don't like scary movies, but this is like one of those classics that everybody says that you have to watch. And I really want to watch it. So I picked this up. I also grabbed some new... Uh, crackers. I guess they're calling these crackers. They are by Club Kellogg. By Clip, it's by Kellogg. Excuse me, but these are considered like the Club brand, and they are crisp, and they are um, in the ranch flavor. Um, 140 calories for 19 crisp, and this is a 7.1 ounce bag. They also have this in the sea salt flavor, so it has just like a basic flavor. And then they have the ranch flavor. I didn't see any other ones. I think these will probably be good in like sour cream and onion. Um, I haven't tried them yet, so hopefully they're good. I don't know. But these are new. Comment down below if you have tried these before. I would love to know how they are. Y'all are never going to guess what Walmart had. I don't know how long they've had it, but it caught my eye. New to me for sure. Not really new. It's something from back in the day that they brought back and made into a cereal. So... I found some Dunkaroo cereal. It's in the family size. It's the only size they had available. So naturally I had to get it. I know I'm extra. And this is a one pound box. It's one pound 
4.6 ounces so it's a pretty big size box of the dunkaroo cereal so we haven't opened it yet i'm curious to see you know if it tastes familiar that kind of thing so um if y'all are into dunkaroos you remember them from way back in the day then go to walmart and check out their um it wasn't in the cereal aisle our walmart is kind of weird it was kind of by the baby section i think it's where they keep like their surplus of family size items so they had that in that section but these are the dunkaroo cereals so um i was excited to see that it says that was then and this is now it's got this little thing on the back of it so that would be pretty neat to try this out and see if it tastes good so the last couple of things that i got from walmart are shoes i know i don't need any more but again i was looking for a gift and I ended up getting the person a pair of shoes. And then of course, I was looking back there myself, which I never get shoes from Walmart because they never have my size, but they have my size this time. So I picked up just some of these, um, don't really know what you call the style of these sandals. I got some last year from Torrid. They kind of remind you of like the Birkenstock style, but not exactly, um, like a cheaper version. Um, they had it in 11, 12 wide width. So I had to pick them up and these are by the Time and True brand and they were $7.98. So I'll show you the tag. They are 11 to 12 wide width for $7.98 by Time and True. I had actually had these in my Walmart cart for the app, the Walmart app since the summertime and I just never got them because I, I think I didn't really believe that they were wide width, but they are. I've tried them on and they really do fit me very well. Like I may even need to adjust these a little bit to make it tighter on my foot. So I was pretty excited about that. Cute pink color again, just something, you know, you wouldn't put this on with a nice, really nice outfit, something to run errands with in the summertime when it gets hot. Um, this weather has been super crazy. I hope that everyone is being safe and everybody's warm. They have everything that they need. Um, the weather has just really been crazy all around, but I hope that everybody, everybody is safe. But when the weather gets warmer, I am looking forward to wearing these. Last thing from Walmart is my last pair of shoes. Um, these are by the Secret Treasures brand, which is like their sleepwear, bedroom slippers. Um, they were in an 1112. They were 997. And these are like the, the crisscross bedroom slippers that are kind of trendy right now. Um, they have these available. They also have them in like a cream color and a baby pink. I didn't want those colors though, so I went with the leopard print. I actually just got a pair of these from Torrid. They had them on sale for $20 and I got them in black. I'm actually wearing them right now. And I picked up a pair of the leopard print from Walmart. So I haven't tried these on yet. I'm sure they fit. They feel pretty big and I'm excited about these. Now for TJ Maxx, I really went in there to grab like a big tote bag. I wanted to find one that had a long strap on it so I could take it to work and put like all of my stuff in it. The tote bags that I have, they just always end up right here on my arm because my arm is just fat. You know, I need like a big strap so it'll stay up there. So I did get a tote bag, but first went through and I looked at their clearance section and they had some of this uh, Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel with sunscreen. So this is similar to what I already have before in my skin routine videos. I already have it. It comes in the tub and it's like 16 or $17. This is the tube version of it and it has sunscreen in it. So this was $6 on clearance at TJ Maxx. And I thought since it has sunscreen, this would be great for me to wear the daytime especially. I haven't had any issues with the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Gel. It works great on my skin and it's really helped to give me that glow that y'all have seen. Right now my skin is very oily from the day but um, before that though it's pretty glowy and it's thanks to that Hydro Boost Gel. So I got it this time with the uh, sunscreen in it. It's SPF 15 so hopefully that'll be enough. If not I have moisturizer that does have sunscreen in it. So I also so also by the registers, y'all know TJ Maxx always gets you with the stuff that they have up front. I picked up a couple bags of chips. They're both by the Deep River Snacks Company. And I got them in Honey Barbecue and Rosemary and Garlic. We've had the Rosemary and Garlic before and it's really good. So these are both $2.99 a piece. Um, I highly recommend the Deep River Snacks. It's kind of like a kettle. It does say kettle cooked on the bag. So uh, we like kettle cooked and these are pretty good. Now the last thing in this haul and the last thing from TJ Maxx is this tote. Um, to me, it's like a nudish pink color. I know that's pretty light, but I love how big it is. 
and this is by the tommy bahama brand so i was excited to see that in there um it was 24.99 at tj maxx that's tommy bahama right there it's actually a reversible bag I'm not planning on reversing it though um, because it's like a snake skin print. I'm not really into that, but I just loved how big it was. So I did pick that up. It has a nice long strap on it, nice thick strap. And then inside of it, it does have a snack closure. And then it also has another little pouch that you can detach as well. So I thought that was pretty neat. I could put all of my stuff in there for work. Um, various things that I need. My lunch bag can fit in here. My water bottle, planner, whatever else I need. So that is everything for my haul. Thank you all so much for watching. And stay tuned because I do have a Dollar Tree haul coming up next. Hope that y'all are being safe and staying warm and that you are well, most importantly. So thank y'all so much for watching and I'll talk to you again in my next video. Bye.